everybody. Welcome to Keyboard Games Book B. Today we're going to look at page four, Yankee Doodle. But before we do, let's sing the hello song. Hello, hello, come sing with me. Play with me and dance with me. We'll have lots of fun, you see, making music together. I'm going to sing German folk song. Bum, ba, ba, bum, bum, bum. While I sing German folk song, I'd like for you to get a scarf. So you go find, see if you can find, probably what would work would be a napkin, or you could use a tissue. You're gonna use something that will feel like a scarf. So my scarf looks like this. So see if you can find a napkin or a tissue or a handkerchief, something that's gonna flow a little bit when you move. And here's what we're gonna do. Use the scarf and pretend to throw pebbles in the water with your scarf, like you're trying to skip stones. We're gonna do that to the macro beats of the song. Bum, ba, bum, here we go. Bum, ba, bum, ba, 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 ba. Bum, ba, bum, ba, 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 ba. Bum, ba, bum, ba, bum, ba, ba. Ba, 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 bum, ba, 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 ba. Ba, ba. And you can put your scarf away. We're going to sing some tonal patterns in minor tonality. Bum, 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 bum. Go ahead and sing after me, please. Bum, bum. Bum, bum. Bum, bum. Bum, bum. La, me. La, me. Me, ti. Me, ti. Si, me. to do movie night. While I chant movie night, I'd like for you to move to the mat micro beats with your arms. This is what we did last time. So this is your arms are moving from your shoulder all the way to your fingertips. Remember that you're just tapping your sides lightly with your fingertips. You're not making a big noise like this. So I'll give you our micro beats when you start. And I'm gonna have you move to those micro beats while I move to the macro beats. Ooh, two beats at once. So I'll get you started. Do da di do da di here I go. Ba 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 Keep moving to your micro beats. I'll keep moving to macro beats. Chant after me. Ba 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 ba. Ba 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 ba. 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 Ba 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 ba. Ba 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 ba. Ba 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 ba. So many different types of patterns that we can do for those. I'm going to sing swinging. Before I sing, I'm going to sing some a special pattern. Bum bum bum. Bum. Just listen to that pattern. Bum, 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 bum. You go ahead and sing it after me. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. I'm going to sing.
doing just a couple parts of it. Bum, 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 bum. I'm going to sing the song now. Go ahead and do whatever move you'd like to do. alternating hands to help me pat the micro beats in the air for the pug and I'm just gonna take a quick look here make sure I've got the pug in my head there we go to do some movements and things to get us ready for our song that we're learning today, our keyboard piece, which is called Yankee Doodle. So I'm going to sing a strong song. Would you please move like robots? Move like a robot. Bum, bum, ba, bum, 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 ba, 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 ba. bum, bum, ba, bum, 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 ba, 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 ba. song again and I'd like for you to echo this resting tone. Bum, bum. Every time I stop singing would you freeze and sing that resting tone. Bum. Here we go. Bum, ba, ba, bum, ba, ba, bum, bum, bum. Bum. Bum, ba, ba, ba. like the first song. I'd like for you to pretend to play drums somewhere on your body. It can be on your arm, it can be on your shoulder, it could be on your tummy or on your legs. So pretend to play drums. But when you play the drums, I'd like for you to play quietly. Don't make a loud sound. Play quietly. So I'm going to play both parts of our song here, the teacher part and the student part. And I'd like for you to play pretend drums on the macro beats. So that's going to be like this. Do, 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 wherever you're playing them. Here you go. Do, do, do. drums on the micro beats. Do day, 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 do day. Figure out where you want to play. Do day, do, here we go. Do day, do day, do day, do day. parts together again and I would like for you to do a slow gentle dance 
while you listen to these parts. So go ahead and do a slow, gentle dance. this song one more time and I'd like for you to take big steps walk with big steps on the macro beats do 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 song that we learned last time, Creepy Crawly. So go ahead and find the keys that you're going to use for this piece and we're going to chant softly and slowly. So remember that you need your high wrist, low wrist. We normally use a pretty flat, even wrist, but for this song, your hands will bump into each other. If you do that so the one on, on the black keys needs a higher wrist, and the one down on the white keys needs a lower wrist. Gently, don't feel like you're shoving your hand into that spot. Our pattern chant is do da di 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 do da di. If you didn't play with me just now, would you please play with me while we play that again? Do da di play with me. Do da di do da di. Do da di do da di. Do da di do da di. ahead and move some more before we come back to the keyboard. I'm going to chant Prancing Colt and I would like for you to move to the macro beats by moving your shoulders. So we did this last time. There we go. Forwards and backwards a little bit. Do day do here we go. Ba 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 Keep moving, chant after me. Ba 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 Thank you. We're gonna do festive dance. Bum 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 ba. I'm going to sing something and I'd like for you to echo it. This is kind of like what we did earlier. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, bum, bum. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, 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 bum. Bum, bum, bum. Bum. I'm going to sing this song now. You can do any move that you like. Now we're going to sing some tonal patterns in major tonality. Do, so, mi, do, ti, do. Go ahead and sing these after me, please. Bum, bum. Bum, bum. Bum, bum. Bum, bum. Do, so. What do you think about that one? Do, so. So, ti. So, ti. So, fa, re, ti. So, fa, re, ti. Do, mi, so. Do, mi, so. Let's go 
onto the keyboard, we're going to do a little bit of improv using a rhythm pattern. And you are going to need a helper for this. So this could be a parent, this could be an older sibling. So if you have someone watching the video with you already, that person is going to be your helper. Don't worry, helper, you'll be fine. If you don't have someone watching the video with you, see if you can come back to this part later and do this with a helper, or maybe you can run now and grab somebody to help you with this part. So we're going to be in triple meter. Do da dee do, do da dee do. So what I'd like is for you to choose a rhythm pattern that uses our macro beats and micro beats. So here is a pattern you could choose. Do da dee do. Here's another one you could choose. Do do da dee. Here's a third one you could choose. Do da dee do da dee. And here's a fourth one you could choose. Do do. So pick one of those four rhythm patterns and have your helper write it down for you so that both of you can remember. And you can go ahead and pause the video to write that down. Then you're going to play anywhere that you want on the piano, just you first. So find wherever you want to be. Maybe over here. So I'm going to have you chant your rhythm pattern and then play it one time. So it'll be like this. I'm going to choose do do da do do da do. So like that, chant your rhythm pattern and then play it one time. Ready, chant. Play. Now I'm going to have you chant your rhythm pattern and play it two times. You can play it on one key or on any keys. So if I do it, it would be do, do, da, di. Do, do, da, di. Do, do, da, di. Your turn. So go ahead and chant your pattern and then play it two times. Ready, chant. Play. Second time. Now is when your helper gets to play. So wherever you are, your helper is going to play in a different part of the piano. You're going to play the rhythm pattern one time. Then your helper is going to play the rhythm pattern one time. And helper, you can just play this on one key if you want. Or whatever the rhythm pattern is that the two of you are doing together. So we're going, I'm going to give you the, the opportunity for both of you to chant it together. Then you play the rhythm pattern. Then your helper plays the rhythm pattern. Ready, chant. You, helper. The last thing we're going to do is you're going to chant the rhythm pattern together. Then you are going to play it two times, and then your helper is going to play it two times. Whoa. All right. Last time. Ready, chant. You. Helper. And let me know how that went when I see you guys at the group class check-in. I'll be interested to know. So now we're going to do a little bit more singing before we come back and play Yankee Doodle. So while I sing Astro, bum, 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 ba, 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 bum, 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 would you gently move your shoulders? Bum, ba, ba, bum, ba, 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 bum, ba, 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 While I 
I'm seeing leaves are falling, would you move very lightly, like leaves gently falling? As I record this, we have lots of leaves falling off the trees. And if you stare outside, if you look long enough, you'll just see a leaf gently float to the ground, and then a leaf over here will float to the ground. It's very beautiful. For Scotty, would you sit down, please? And I think you can still see at least my head when I sit. And would you please move your upper body in all of the space possible? I'm not quite sure how much you can see, so I'll get this way. And then we're going to do Dalmatian dance. Would you help me move alternating heels to the micro beats? That means your toes will stay on the floor and you'll have one heel up and then the other heel up. And you go back and forth. Here we go. Let's go ahead and come to the keyboard. So our other creative thing that we're doing today, so I'm gonna sit here, but you actually need to get a piece of paper and you can do this now or you can do this after you're done with the video. Either way is totally fun. So for our second creative activity today, I would like for you to draw a picture and it can be a picture of anything that you want, or if you don't know what to draw, you could draw some different kinds of hats. And then you could have a helper help you cut out a feather. So draw a feather on a piece of paper and cut out the feather. Then you could put the feather in the different hats like they do in the Yankee Doodle song. Put a feather in his cap. So draw a picture, any picture that you'd like, or if you don't know what to draw, you can draw a picture of hats Think of the hats being light, so not heavy, very light hats. And then we're going to use that picture next time for our improv. So we're gonna use that and we're gonna make some music about that picture. So save the picture, maybe put it right in your book when you're done with it. So you can do that now or you can wait and do that at the end of the video. If you do that now, go ahead and pause. So we're going to learn to play Yankee Doodle. So to get us ready for what we're gonna do for this song, I'd like for you to play any two piano keys that are right next to each other at the same time. So if you look at the piano keyboard, if you have two of these white keys, they might be right next to each other, like these two, or they might not be right next to each other because there might be a black key stuck in the middle. So if that's the case, make sure you play any two keys that are right next to each other with nothing in between. When you play those at the same time, you can use your pointer finger or your middle finger. Your pointer finger might be easier and make sure you don't stick your fingers out like this. We're not poking the keys. Have your whole hand together, hanging nicely from your shoulder. Like that. We'll be here. So after you've practiced that, find any black piano key with this hand. This is 
is your right hand. So any black piano key, I'll move over here. And then find with the other hand, the white piano key that's closest to that black key. Can you play those two at the same time? Notice what that feels like to play both hands with those two keys at the same time. So now take a look at page four in your book. This is Yankee Doodle and find those two keys. So notice your left hand, this hand is going to play a white key. Your right hand, this hand is going to play this black key. And it's got this funny little bracket. It actually looks like one of them is just hanging on on a hook. So it has the bracket saying that the two keys are going to play at the same time. So find both of those keys. We count one set of two black keys. And then with the second one, here we are. And these are the two keys we're going to need. Then you, what you do is you use our rhythm pattern chant, which is do, 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 do. I'll get us started. Do, day, do, play like this. Do, 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 do. You can join me whenever you like. Do, 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 do. So you play that and then I'll play the duet with you. Get your two hands ready. I'm going to play that with one hand so I have a hand free to play the duet part. Do, day, do, ready, play. are crunching together. If you're having trouble with that, you could do this. You could listen to the audio track four and listen to them play the song and you could walk around in a circle and you could use your two hands and you could pat do. Now if you do that, make sure your hands don't just go up and down. Notice how my hands are stopping. Make your hands move in a circle so that they're always flowing always moving, even when they're pulsing to play the do's. So for example, you could listen to it and go do, 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 do. So that's something to try if you're having trouble with this. Another thing that you can do, and this is just for fun, I can play this part you can chant anything that you want in duple meter. So I could play this. You could chant do day do do day do. You could chant do do day do day do day. So you can have someone help you at home play the student part and you can chant anything that you want. Or you can play anything that you want on any black piano keys. We're going to do one more thing before we're done today. So we reviewed last time the apple and the worm. Go ahead and play that with me and then I'm going to teach you the duet part. So I'm going to play the duet with you while you play the student part with me. Get both hands ready. Page two in Keyboard Games Book A. Pause if you need to to go grab that book. to find the duet part for the 
apple and the worm. So I wrote in my book here the keys that you're going to use. And I wrote a bracket for number one, those are the first keys, and number two, those are the second keys. So take a look at this. Go ahead and mark this down in your book and pause the video if you need to, to mark this down. So you're going to have one hand that plays just this black key. And then the other hand is going to go back and forth between these two black keys. So it looks like this. This hand just plays try playing that with me. You can slowly practice that on your own, playing those two keys and those two keys, going back and forth. And whenever you're ready, try playing with me. If you're having trouble, you can play just one hand while I'm playing both hands. You could play this one. You could play this one. Either way is fine. you can play right now. So if you can play just one hand, that's just great. If you can play two hands, that's also great. So whatever part you can play, you play for the student duet. And I'm going to play the student part. that I just started in without telling you when to start. That wasn't very helpful of me. Let's do it one more time and I'll give you a better introduction this time. Do day do play with me. Do day 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 do day. So when you're playing at home I'd like for you to practice playing the duet part and have a helper play the student part and then you can trade back and forth. You can play one and the helper plays the other and then you switch parts. So I'd like for you to practice that at home. And now it's time to sing the goodbye song. Bye, bye, goodbye. Bye, bye, goodbye. What a shame we're ending today. Next time we will sing and play. Bye, bye, goodbye. Bye, bye, goodbye. Thank you. Have a good day. Bye.